As Ukrainian soldiers tested their weapons, their president shot down criticism he's minimizing the threat of war to his people. It's not that we're acting as if it's not the highest level of threat. We are getting prepared for the high threats, but we understand the reality that we are in. Vladimir Zelensky says his country is ready to defend itself should the Kremlin order its soldiers to move into Ukraine. And he urged Western countries not to create panic. When it comes to the threat of war, Russia again said it's not their country's objective. If it depends on us, the Russian Federation, there will be no war. A line Zelensky outright rejects. They can do everything. They have a powerful army. Why do you need drills to happen specifically here? It's not just Russian troops Ukraine is contending with. Can you share any information about any of those sort of physical or cyber attacks that have been identified or prevented? So we uh, have had quite a number of cyber attacks. We have prevented uh, those and uh, we did manage to restore and recommission many uh, websites of our government institutions. In terms of the physical attacks, I think the strong, our strong is our team is strong is that we can preemptively prevent knowing that there could be casualties if we don't. Western leaders are working to try to defuse tensions. In a phone call Friday, Russian President Vladimir Putin told France's Emmanuel Macron that the U.S. and NATO had not addressed Russia's key concerns. We are working hard uh, for the best uh, peaceful political solution, but we're also prepared for the worst. The Canadian government says it's doing what it can to support Ukraine. The defense minister is expected to travel to the country in the coming days. Jeff? Crystal Gomancing in Kiev, Ukraine. Thanks, Crystal.